My dear students, today we'd like to discuss about a very very genius short trick here. What is that short trick? Uh, let us discuss about that. You can just see the question and textbook solution also. What is this question actually? Let us discuss about that. There is a string, okay? And uh, the fundamental frequencies are given here. Uh, resonant frequencies are given. There are two frequencies given, uh, which is taken as 315 heads and they are also 420 heads here okay and there is no other frequency in between these two frequencies it is given like that isn't it and the lowest frequency of the string is going to be how much that means fundamental frequency you have to find out okay and you all know in this case of a string uh, we can bypass all these methods and directly we can solve the problem how can you solve the problem directly first i'll tell you after that uh, i'll tell you the reason behind that also instead of doing all this stuff what you can do is you know these two are the frequencies if you find the difference between them the answer is ready here that's it isn't it so 420 minus 315 is already giving you 150 105 heads need not do all this stuff here isn't it it's a waste of time why should we do all this nuisance and nonsense let us just make the difference of that and get the answer that's it isn't it now why we have to do the difference that is a question before us that we will discuss about that now what is the reason behind that is you all know that uh, fundamental frequency is uh, uh, v by 2l and second one is 2v by 2l and third one is 3v by 2l if you uh, see all these the gap is going to be only one okay the gap is going to be uh, what is the ratio actually so if you do n1 is to n2 is to n3 the ratio is 1 is to 2 is to 3 and so on like this isn't it this is the ratio here okay so if the successive frequencies are given if you make the difference okay if you make the difference between these two like for example 3v by 2l and 2v by 2l 3v by 2l minus 2v by 2l you are going to get v by 2l which is going to be the fundamental frequency here okay so if you want to find out the fundamental frequency you just subtract the frequencies which are beside then you'll get v by 2l directly why should we do all these things so just make the difference find the difference and get the answer directly hope you have enjoyed thank you very much